congratulations on the film. Thank you. Um, are you still kind of in shock about the, the kind of the impact that the film's had, not just in terms of box office, but in terms of the fans and everything else? I mean, it, it's gone pretty pretty berserk this one. Yeah, I, we really didn't. I mean, we knew that we were always working on something special, and it was always something that we really loved ourselves to have it go so kind of wide, so widely recognized, and to have so many people, you know, have it mean so much to so many people is just incredibly gratifying. It's really, it's wonderful. It's, I don't know, I, you know, didn't expect it, but I couldn't ask for more. Yeah. I bet it was, uh, I mean, I can imagine it was fantastic seeing all this put together, but when you were seeing the performances, particularly from, from Joaquin, I mean, it must have been great to, uh, to see, but also you didn't want to cut too much out given that he'd given such a great performance. No, I mean, it's, it really made the job harder because you didn't really want to cut anything. It's, if I could have shown everybody everything, I would because he's, he really every frame that he was in, he was, it was, was true and was doing something wonderful. Yeah. Um, even the things that didn't make it, you know, it's just hard choices. Yeah. And in terms of, I mean, Todd obviously had a very specific vision for this for this movie. What was it that he said to you in the first instance about what he was trying to do? I mean, because he, he, there's a lot of Scorsese movies that he used as his kind of blueprint, if you like. Was that something that he wanted you to, to capture in terms of the editing and the way that you were putting it together? Well, yeah, I mean, in terms of in terms of putting it together and having references, it was just about anything from, you know, 1970 to 1981, really. Uh, it was, you know, I, I, I kind of asked him at the beginning of the summer, what do you want me to be watching? He just said anything from the 70s. Um, and we wanted to make it feel like it had this this kind of um, as though it had been made during that time. We actually went back through during the, the making of the movie and um, kind of removed some cuts just to, to emulate the style more, saying like, okay, this is when you could hold takes longer, and that's when people, you know, you did hold takes longer. It wasn't lots of quick cuts, yeah. and that was kind of the idea of putting it together for us. Yeah. Uh, as far as the movie that we wanted to make, it was super clear just from the script. I thought it was it was. Just, as clear a script as I've ever seen as to kind of like what was behind it. Yeah, and there's that final sequence, not to go any way to people who, someone who hasn't seen it out there, but the sequence with on the chat show with him and Robert De Niro, there's a real tension in there. I mean, was that a difficult scene for you to put together or was it quite easy? Because I guess you have to put in, make sure you put in enough to make it tense, but also not to to put, take away from, from Robert De Niro and Joaquin Phoenix's performances in that instance. I, I mean, I think everything was difficult, but it was, um, in that one in particular, I, I'd say we, the the idea was to kind of keep it down there in this almost like a, a boxing ring or something between the two heavyweights and it was just kind of this crucible where you knew something was going to happen but um but you know it's just when it was going to happen and it, it kind of you know tips slowly over the over the course of the scene it's a you know you have an idea of what he might be he might be up to when he gets there and by the end it's it's something entirely different yeah and what's your as a final question there what's your kind of favorite memory you'll take away from this this project and will it do you think it will it will enable you to do things you might have not been able to do in your career beforehand or is it just a good learning experience to do something like this i mean i i hope it does but this is this is kind of what i've always been building towards in my career this is it's it's pretty much the perfect project it was a, it's a great script it's an incredible actor and it's a director whom i love that i that nobody i'd rather work with so uh you know if i could do if I could do something else, it would be just kind of this all over again. <laughs> That's it. Well, wish you all the best. Thank Congratulations. Thank you so much. Ladies and gentlemen, you're watching Hey You Guys. Hey You Guys, huh? Hey you guys, Is that yeah. from the Goonies? It is indeed, yeah. Nice. Hey!